What's up everybody, quick video here to share with all of you on how you can transfer your Google Keep Notes directly over to your Apple iPhone Notes. This is my method for doing it and it works quick and easy. If any of you know of a different, faster, easier way, please share it in the comments below. So what I do is go ahead and go into the app Google Keep there's my notes. For some of you, yours might look like, you know, be in that format or in this format. But what I do is I go ahead and I open up one of the notes. And then down on the lower right corner, there are three little dots. That is actually a menu and it's kind of hiding down here. Select that and it brings up this screen here. You can choose send and then scroll across and you can open up notes by clicking notes like that. Or if you don't see notes listed there, click more, look for notes, open up notes, and it allows you right here just to simply click save. And then if I get out of here and go in to the actual iPhone notes, you can see I have one new note and right there is my store list. So it is that simple. And if you want to transfer your other ones over directly underneath what you would do, go back into Google Keep and I'll go back into say, this note here open this note choose those three little dots click send come over choose notes so what you want to do here is you don't want to save it to the store list note that we already transferred you want to select this and choose create new note and then click save then you can get back out go into notes and now you will have two notes in there with the proper title and everything at least that's how it's working for me so one more thing i want to show you that you can do i don't know if any of you will be interested in doing this or not but if we go back into google keep and say i want to add my store list to this particular note so i'd open up the store list one go to that little menu click send and then i can go ahead and choose the notes app and then what it does is it gives me the option now to save that note to my other notes. So if I wanna save that note to the August 2014 note, instead of creating a new note, I can just simply choose this and click save. And now if we go back into notes, and I go to August, at the bottom, I should have the store list right here. There's my store list. So that is actually kind of neat. At the same time you're doing this process of moving Google Keep Notes over to Apple Notes, you can consolidate notes at the same time or create new notes. If you did find this video useful, hit that like button and I will see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching.